Hi, welcome to Lessons with John. Uh, today we're going to talk about Bruno. All right, second string. I'm going to hit the first fret and then the third fret of the second string, just like that. Okay, so those chords were I'm barring the third fret and uh, second string, fourth fret. 5th string at the 5th fret, I'm uh, sorry, 4th string at the 5th fret, <laughs> I added a string to the uke. So you bar the 3rd fret, 2nd uh, string 4th fret, and then the 4th string at the 5th fret. That's an A flat chord. Uh, this one's going to be a tough one, sorry. So we're going to go uh, on that one, we're going to go down, down, up, down, up, down. Then uh, you could go to a regular G chord if you want, I'm just going to pull that same shape back to the 2nd fret. Up, down, up, down, up, down, up. So that's a G chord. Uh, it's your bar in the second fret, second string, third fret, fourth string, fourth fret. Okay, so because it's the same shape, I'm just going to move it around because it happens quite a bit in the song like this. Um, so it sounds like this. This is your, uh, we don't talk about Bruno the first time when they come in. So it's like. So what I'm doing for a strum there on the A flat is I'm going down, down, up, down, up, down. Then when I go to the G chord, move it back, I go up, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Then I go back to the A flat, do the same strum I did on the A flat. Down, down, up, down, up, down. Go back to the G. This time I'm going to change it to up, up, down, 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 down. Just like that. Okay? Hopefully that makes sense. All right, now you have the uh, the wedding day part. The, uh, I'm calling this the verse. So um, she's got the wedding day, not a cloud in the sky. So it's a C minor, F minor to G. So let me just play through it. So. a C minor. Uh, for the C minor, I'm just barring the, the top three strings at the third fret, fourth strings open, that's my C minor chord. Then I'm going to an F minor, fourth string, first fret, second string, first fret, first string, third fret. And I gotta have that third string ringing open in between. Okay, that's my F minor. Then I'm going to go to a regular G chord, uh, third string, second fret, first string, second fret, second string, third fret. That's my G chord, then back to the F minor, okay? And then I do do that A flat G thing like I did earlier, okay? So the C minor is down, down, up. The F minor is down, up, down. So it sounds like. Then when I go to the G chord, I'm going to go up, up, down, up. Then back to the F minor, down, up, down, up. And that's my little, you know, was my wedding day. You do this three times. Then you go to that A flat that we talked about earlier in the intro and then two, three, four, five, pull it back to the G. So five times, one, two, three, four, five, and then once on the G, then you're back to the C minor, the F minor, G, to the F minor, minor to F minor to G to the F minor. You do that three times and that's your verse. And now we don't talk about Bruno again, it's just that A flat to the G thing. This time we're going to do it eight times on each one. We don't talk about Bruno's G chord. A flat, they repeat it. So it's just eight times on each chord and we're calling that the chorus. Okay? Then you go back and you do the C minor part again. That's what we're calling the verse. We're going to do that all again. And then the chorus again. We don't talk about Bruno. It's that A flat to the G eight times each. Uh, now you're off to the bridge. OK? 
Okay, so that's the bridge C minor again. This time I'm going to go down, down. This is the, the fish part where, you know, she had a fish. One day, it, you know, the next day it, it's dead because, you know, Bruno. So you got C minor, you're going to hit it twice, down, down. Stop the sound, then F minor, same thing. Go to a regular G chord, wait, and then up, up, down, up. And you do that three times in a row, so it sounds like... G coming up. Okay, you do that three times and then you go to the A flat again and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, G, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So the G is, again, I'm just moving that. Uh, I'm not going to do this bar and then whip around. You could be fine, like, if you feel better about that, but then you have to go back to the bar most of the time, or some of the time anyway. All right, now we have the big, long, huge, I'm calling it verse 3. It's totally different from the other verses. Um, you could call it bridge 2 if you wanted. It, it's, um, it's totally different. So it's an E flat chord. Da, 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 to B flat, ba, 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 C minor, da, da, then to an A flat. And then E flat, da, 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 B flat, da, 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 C minor, da, 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 A flat. Then the same chords, but you hit them eight times each. Again, you repeat E flat to B flat, da 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 da, C minor to the A flat. Okay, so and then uh, I guess we need to go over those chords. So E flat, first string, first fret, third string, third fret, second string, third fret. That's my E flat. Then you need a B flat. You cover the top two strings of the first fret, and then the third string, second fret, fourth string, third fret. That's my B flat. Then the C minor you already know. And then the A flat. It's actually easy when you got the C minor. You can just add these two fingers to the A flat. It becomes very simple. So what I'm doing there in this section is I'm just hitting each chord once. E flat, B flat, and then C minor and then the A flat, and then I repeat that, and then we go back and we do the same chords, but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, all downs. I'm gonna repeat that. I'm gonna go right into the next little part. Um, it's A flat to G, and they divide the measure up like one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. So the A flat is three times, one, two, three, and then the G is one, two, three, four, five. So it's like it's the same rhythm as like the choruses, but it's it's divided differently. So it's got that cool syncopated sound. Okay, and you do that actually four times. This is like one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. A flat, G, A flat, G, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then you're gonna do the... So that chord is an A flat minor. The way that I'm doing it is the first string, second fret, the third string, third fret, the fourth string, fourth fret, and the second string, fourth fret, and that uh, might be a new chord for you. Uh, it's an A flat minor. That's how I came up with it. Uh, it's it's like two measures of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think I cut it short. I think they cut it short on seven. They don't go to the eight because they they're on their way to the next part. Give yourself like a little bit of buffer there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Then you're back, which is going to be the outro. Okay, so that verse 3 is uh, pretty complicated, but um, you can see I keep looking over here. I got the sheet there, and there'll be a link that you can uh, take a look at my work and stuff, and um, you'll be able to match it up pretty easily, I think. Okay, and um, the outro is basically just the verse again uh, with a chorus and a C minor at the end. So the outro is a C minor, same strum as we did earlier in the verse, so... F minor, G, F minor, C minor, to F minor, to G, F minor, C minor, to F minor, to G, F minor, and then the A flat to the G, 
and then they go back C minor to F minor to G, F minor. Three times. And then the A flat, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, to G. Again, it's like a chorus. And you just end on the... <laughs> Uh, the C minor at the end, okay? And just hit it once, and that's it. So that's We Don't Talk About Bruno. I hope you uh, you get it. It's um, it's pretty complicated, all his stuff are, you know, all that Hamilton stuff. And, but um, this one was pretty doable. It wasn't too bad, so. And everybody seems to want it, so. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button, please subscribe, and play more Ook.